March 9th, 2007. Please welcome Mark Consuelos. <laughs> You see, the, the I'm, I'm the, starting to get a complex well, the because this the, is all for you. It's the, not for me. The, the, the problem the problem with this is that when I go home and I open the door to go into the house... Is that a toilet down? Nothing. <laughs> he walks in and we're like, oh, uh, hey. Hi. Home to meet your parents? Yeah. The meal? He took me home to meet his parents and the meal was... Okay, brace yourself. It was calf's tongue with tuna paste. <laughs> No, it's actually so you a like delicacy. Cat's tongue, and I said, of course I like it. <laughs> but you liked it. It was good. It was good, right? But again, I was trying to seal the deal and impress your mother with how developed my palate was, right. even though, I mean, come on! <laughs> and the next time you came over, we had rabbit. I know. It was really, I mean, I was like, what's wrong? No squirrel lying about? <laughs> And what else? What else is a crazy one? I was walking one? by the market and I found a pigeon dead in the street. Yeah. <laughs> but because of my mom has pushed you, you, you pretty much eat anything now. Yeah, no, it's true. You know? It's it's really true. And, I mean, do you remember, we, we, um, Michael was about six months old, right? And I was only nursing him. He had never had any sort of food at all. And, you know, they say when you start feeding your baby, you should start with you know, some mashed bananas or a cereal. You don't want <laughs> to develop any. Take it slow. You don't want to, the baby to develop any allergies whatsoever. So we come home. My mother-in-law was with the baby. And I, he's sitting in his high chair. He's got a bib around him. And he's eating a plate, a plate of calamari fra diablo. <laughs> She blended and it though. Then, it was in a blender, so it was like a parade. And I said, <laughs> this baby has I was teeth. Like, yes, exactly. She goes, Kelly, this baby has the teeth. And when the baby has the teeth, then you feed the baby because it can chew. And I said, yeah, but Mom, I mean, what about, you know, like a fish allergy or the spices? She goes, Oh no, I feed all of my baby from the breast to the calamari. <laughs> incident of 97. Yeah. <laughs> and I think when you were pregnant, she actually smuggled a roast beef into the hospital. Into the hospital no, it was under after her I coat. had the baby. Yeah. She came in. I'm not kidding. I was like in the hospital. Yeah. I was only, because I had a C-section. And so I was only allowed to have clear liquids, tea and jello. <laughs> and she comes in, she whips off her coat and she says, I have a roast. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Thank I you so like, much for I don't want we don't want her to stop cooking all this stuff. No, my it's gosh, amazing. she's the best. Yeah, Are you kidding? I mean, it's like I, you don't understand. It, when I when we go like if we go anywhere out to dinner, we'll come. It's home. kind of a letdown, right? Well, no, it's a letdown. But she's she'll if she's with the kids, she's like I made 16 different sauces and I froze them and labeled them all for you. Oh. She's the best. <laughs> and she can fit an entire roast under her coat. <laughs> And I love it when she cooks. She has a habit of saying, and her name her name's uh, Camila, yeah. right? So she she'll say, and you do such a good impression. She says she takes it and she goes, Camila, this is good. <laughs> and we're thinking I like her this cooking show. She should Camila, have a cooking this show. This is good. Camila, this is good. This is. How good. much parsley? A lot. A lot. How, How much garlic? Put in the garlic. How much? She goes a lot. <laughs> this is like. The measurement is like a lot. This much, this much, two handful. Right. Right? But you know what? Last night's dinner was great. Oh, Damien Faye.